friends welcome or welcome back to my edu space hope you all are doing and learning well in previous video we learned about the modification of cell envelope in prokaryotic cell in which we studied in brief about nuclei and membrane in this video we are going to look at the differences between the nuclei and fibrin so Let's get started. Now you must be thinking that both pili and fibri are extensions on the body surface of bacteria. Then how they are different from each other? So here is your answer. Let me take their differences one by one. So the structure. You can see over here. this is the body surface of a bacterial cell and these are the extensions coming out from the body surface some are very short and some are bigger than these short structure those short hair like structures are called villi and those which are bristles like are fimbri so villi is short hair like microfibers extends out from the body of bacterial cell whereas fimbri are very short bristle type microfibers extends out from the bacterial body surface you have to note out one thing in some book it is also mentioned that pili is of two type attachment pili and sex pili that i have already told you in my previous video the attachment pili is called fimbri so attachment pili and fimbri are same now next is length pili ranges from 20 micrometer or more whereas fimbri are short structures ranges from 0.2 to 20 micrometer now the number pili are lesser in number as compared to fimbri pili number ranges from 3 to 10 per bacterial cell on the other hand on fimbri the ranges varies from 100 to 600 per bacterial cell in terms of thickness you can see pili are much thicker structure in this picture you can see these are much thicker structure than this so pili are 200 to 300 angstrom in diameter whereas fimbri are 65 to 140 angstrom in diameter next is the distribution pili can be distributed evenly throughout the body surface or either at one end or both ends whereas fimbri are distributed throughout the bacterial body surface you can see in this the pili are distributed throughout the body surface and in this picture you can see uh, the pili are concentrated at the one end of of a bacterial cell in this bacterial cell you can see the pili are concentrated on both the ends of bacterial cell now rigidity rigidity means the stiffness or difficult to bend the pili are much rigid structure than that of fimbri composition pili uh anyways both pili and fimbri are composed of composed primarily of proteins but pili uh, pili having different protein and fimbri having different protein the pili is composed of protein called pilin on the other hand fimbri is composed of protein called 
fimbrillin. Now, the formational genes. The bacterial plasmid or we can say extra chromosomal gene regulate the formation of pili whereas the bacterial chromosomal genes is uh, is, is is regulate the production of fimbrin next is on the basis of motility pili can move and perform crawling motility on the other hand fimbri cannot move thereby cannot take part in motility next occurrence pili always present on gram negative bacteria okay pili always occurs in gram negative bacteria but it is also seen that in some gram positive bacteria the pili are present but in fimbri they occur both in gram positive as well as gram negative bacteria now the receptors presence of receptor on their bacterial cell pili have some receptors for viruses on the other hand fimbri they are receptorless functionally both are far different from each other. Pili perform two functions. That is, first one is in gene transfer or bacterial conjugation from one bacterial cell to another bacterial cell. And the second is motility. On the other hand, fimbri helps to adhere to the body surfaces. Now the examples, the examples of, examples of the bacterial cell having pili are Schizella dysentery. Schizella dysentery, it causes schizellosis, that is bacterial dysentery and it is gram negative bacteria. Whereas uh, Neisseria gonorrhoeae having fimbri structures, it causes gonorrhea which is a sexually transmitted disease. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to leave your comments. Thank you.